In this video, I will be showing you guys how much my small YouTube channel with almost 3000 subscribers is making through YouTube ads. So let's get into it. Hey guys, welcome to a brand new video here on my YouTube channel, Nimul TV, where I post lots of video editing and photo editing tutorials as well as vlogs. So if this is your first time watching my videos, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on the bell notifications so you won't be missing any of the cool videos that I try to post on my YouTube channel. So as I promised to you guys in the beginning of this video, I'm going to be talking about how much money you can make with a small YouTube channel like mine with almost 3000 subscribers. So I started my YouTube channel in January 2020. So right now that I'm recording this video, it's January 10th, 2021. So it's almost a year. And it took me about six months to get to my first 1000 subscribers. I actually made a video on how I got to my first 1000 subscribers. I'm just going to put a link uh, up here and also below in the description. Check that out. So it took me about six months to get to my first 1000 subscribers and also that 4000 uh, hours of watch time. And once my channel was monetized, I started getting revenues out of YouTube ads which were showing in the beginning and middle of my videos on my YouTube channel. So when you start your YouTube channel, you don't know exactly how much money you're going to be able to making out of the YouTube ads, although that's not the only revenue resource for YouTubers, but that's like the most basic source of income for YouTube channels. So in this video, I will be taking you guys into the analytics of my YouTube channel and I'm going to be showing you guys how much on average my videos are making per 1000 views that they are bringing into my YouTube channel. And one of the important things that you need to know when it comes to the ad revenue out of the, your YouTube channel, it's the niche that you are uh, creating your YouTube videos on. So because depending on how competitive your niche is, the ad revenue is going to be different. For example, if you are posting vlogs, it's usually less expensive to kind of have ads on those videos than a very like specific video, which is about like an unboxing, like photography, like camera reviews or stock market videos. So depending on the niche that you're making your videos on, your revenue is going to be different. And one of the most important terminologies when it comes to YouTube ad revenue is the CPM or cost per mail or it's literally how much money you're going to be making through ads per 1000 views that you're going to be getting on your videos. So over here you can see my YouTube channel's dashboard. At the time of recording this video, we are at 2,785 subscribers and within the last 28 days, we've made $104 through YouTube ad revenues. So if you want to like take a really like deep look into how this ad revenue on my YouTube channel is working, uh, I'm just going to take you guys to my YouTube analytics. Uh, all right. So if I click on my uh, estimate revenue, you can see how much money I'm making per day. So I usually post one video per week and depending on how well those videos are going to be doing, my revenue in that month is going to be different. So on average, I'm making about $4, I would say, out of my YouTube ads with this number of subscribers and my views per 48 hours is on 2,600 views. So depending on how many videos you've got, uh, this number is just going to be increasing and relatively your revenue is going to be higher or lower. So on average, I'm making $4 per day so if you multiply it by 28 days it's going to be roughly around 100 dollars however this number is not always the same sometimes it's lower sometimes it's higher and each video is going to be making you different revenue depending on uh how much competitive the topic that you've chosen is for that video that you made so once i click on the revenue tab over here it's going to be showing me how much my CPM on average is. So the average CPM for my YouTube channel is $9.51. So this is the money that I'm making on average for every 1000 views that I'm bringing into my YouTube channel. Of course, it's going to be different depending on the video and the average is 9.51. So if I like just scroll down, I'm going to be able to see how much money I've been making 
uh, depending on the month. So in August, I made $69, September $89. And uh, sometimes it's higher, sometimes it's lower. So right now we are in January 2021. So we are not all the way through the month. That's why it's lower. And in December, I made $108 based on the number of views and the number of subscribers that I just showed you. And as I mentioned, each video is going to be making you different amounts of money. For example, uh, this video made $46 uh, during the last 28 days. And if I switch this into lifetime, you're going to be able to see how much money this video has made for me since it was published. So this video made $187 for me. The second one made $74, $55, $52. So depending on the video, it's going to be different. And if I switch to advanced mode over here, we're going to be able to see how much the CPM is for every video. So if you want to see how much the CPM is, I'm just going to click on this plus button over here and I'm going to be adding the CPM. To my column so right now you're going to be able to see how much each 1000 views on these videos have has been making for me so on this video is seven dollars on this video is four dollars so as you can see it's not a fixed number depending on what the niche is and how many videos within that niche is out there on youtube this is going to be different so we have five dollars six dollars over here so this video just made twelve dollars this one made $17. This is like a really high CPM that uh, I cannot imagine how I'm going to be able to get the same CPM on the other niches. So this is the video that I made about how to design a business car. So probably there are not that many of videos around this which are useful. So that's why the CPM is relatively high, really high on this video. However, the average uh, through the lifetime of my channel is $6.72. And depending on the time that you're going to take a look at, this number is going to be different. So if I switch this to 28 days, it's going to be $8. So just make sure you're looking into the right time frame when you're uh, taking a look at your analytics. So if I uh, just scroll down, I have videos that are not making any money. I haven't monetized them. I have $2, $5. So as you can see, depending on what the topic of your video is, your revenue is going to be different. And if I just click on the audience tab to just show you where the watch time and the viewers are coming from, if I just scroll down, you're going to be able to see that the watch time, 96.6% .6 of them were not subscribed and only 3.4% of them we're already subscribed to my YouTube channel. So, so if you're among the 96.6% of the non-subscribed viewers on my YouTube channel, I think now is the right time to just stop, hit that subscribe button and turn on your bell notifications. So that would be greatly appreciated. And over here, you can see that around 24.4% of the viewers were out of United States, 15% from India, Philippines, United Kingdom, and then Pakistan. So depending on uh, what the topic and the language of your uh, YouTube channel is, uh, your geographical location is going to be different. All right, guys. So this is an in-depth look at my personal YouTube channel that I've started about a year ago. I literally show you how much money I'm making out of my uh, videos. And I hope that this is going to give you some insights. If you're just starting your YouTube channel, just post on a regular basis, have your content calendar. And as the time passes, you're going to get more subscribers and you're going to have more viewers and it's just going to lead into higher revenue. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know below in the comments if you had any questions that I couldn't cover uh, during this video. And as always, thank you for watching. So if you found value in this video, make sure to subscribe and turn on your bell notifications. And of course, like the video. So, you know, YouTube algorithm really likes when you like the video and it's just going to start showing it to more people. So thank you for watching. Please stay around. See you in the next video and mochles.